I am at 91 hours. <laughs> I just randomly opened Steam. 91 hours, already building a, a uh, very, very big station. <laughs> uh, yeah, but we have to keep in mind my progression isn't like the usual progression. Well, uh, I think I showed you what my first uh, project was. Very small compared to this. Uh, who's sure about that? Oh, wait, I think we're not talking about the same project. <laughs> yeah, oh, I forgot the giant thing you never finished. <laughs> yeah. That's it simply was good. too big and just looked like a brick. Afterward, I tried to break it up a, bit, a little, but uh, there was just. It was too just big. too big. There was no saving it. Just, just be honest. Yeah. There was... Okay, there's a programmable block. Then I need to remove two of those. Hang on. What are you doing currently? Are you just already building it home? Uh, yes. Out of the miner. Alright. I just need to get... What do I need to get? And maybe you can even just leave it, leave the hills on to act as cushions since they can take a punch. Yeah, that. Uh, well, I didn't really plan on altering the design like at all. Just putting into into it the relevant blocks so it could function, and then uh, just call it a day, <laughs> so to speak. But how can I set up? Button for when I'm not in a control seat so that it stops following me or starts following me. Uh, we can do that pretty easily via, uh, well, just a button on the whole of the, uh, what's it called, of the, of the miner. It's that simple. Oh, oh we use one of those fancy panels. Yeah, of course. Hey, yes, 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 yes. yes. <laughs> uh. Why is this okay? Just the fact you can go on the bottom of those panels makes me excited like a little kid. At least I hope they are available in small grid, otherwise, uh, well, I'm pretty sure I can get something fancy to work. <laughs> that shouldn't be an issue. What are they called? Access panels. Yes, access panels. Okay. Uh, let me check. Uh, now I need are. a button. They are. They just are smaller. Hey. They don't have the side panel that is useless. They only have the one panel with the button behind it. Nice. Even better. I forgot that I need it. Where did I put the... Ah, oh, yes. I've removed it. Oh, this is a pen. Huh? Uh, no, 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 nothing. Fuck it to myself. <laughs> you just replaced the vent with something. No, I thought I was looking at a conveyor junction, but it was a vent. Hey. I was checking out the whole again. Is this the right one? Uh. That should be the right one. At least I hope so. Mine actually also has one big benefit. If it ever comes out of fuel or power, we just load a bit of ice into the... into the system. Yeah, but you need to kickstart it. Well, no. You just need to put ice into it. Yes, and then it needs to have a little battery, and then it works. It has batteries all over it. Nice. It has, it has one of the, it has large batteries all over it, I remember correctly. Nice. 
Oh. Huh? I don't think that's a good thing. What? Why are these batteries have no lights on but they have Oh they are Wait are these draining? Yes they are draining. We have a too heavy power usage then. Yes, they do. The Tycoon station is using up a lot of power apparently already. You probably should turn it off. But I don't get what is using the power. Oh, we are already 12% on. <laughs> Congratulations! Uh, what? Does this thing just look like that not have a power generation in the board? You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> That's the issue. This thing simply can't generate. Merge blocks and connectors don't disconnect the middle of power. Right? Okay, the access panels, none of those has a button inside. Damn it. And what does what does it have inside? Uh, it's only for large grid. So it's just a creation of small grid. Yeah, kinda. <laughs> I know it's I also very like it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, okay. Yeah, station. Yeah. Disorientation in space. I spun around four to five times, baby. I'm gonna install three or four buttons so you don't have to search forever. When you wanna uh, want it to not follow. And one more. <laughs> nice. Okay. It probably will still need assistance uh, when uh, trying to park. Or, well, probably still need, it most definitely needs assistance when trying to park. But other than that, uh, it will follow you as soon as I have set it up correctly. I, I just place a temporary small warfare uh, reactor on the anchor ship, like I re re renamed it. Mm -hmm. And it doesn't just turn off in a second. Okay, I have turned collision avoidance and precision mode on. Uh, do you want the speed limit on it? Uh, that did 30. 30 meters a second? Yes. Okay. To go faster than that. 30 meters a second. That's still quite fast. For it is, old. yes. <laughs> yeah, it's still lethal if it hits me at that speed. Yeah. The follow distance, 20 meters. Uh, sounds good. Then, how do you select which player it follows? Uh, select objective, follow player, autopilot. Can I select you here? I can't. Follow player, okay. 
you gotta sit inside the cockpit and tell it that uh, it should follow and then it should On the eight. Eight. Yes. After that, you shouldn't be able to uh, turn it with your mouse. At least, hopefully, you can still turn it. Okay. Then also, uh, hang on. Autopilot enabled. Yes. Uh, the AI behavior block isn't enabled. Oh, damn it. Hang on. I'm gonna get this done real quick. The oh, eye behavior on off and autopilot on off. The cockpit was at fifty-eight percent. Okay, nice. Okay, now you can move and it should theoretically follow. Since you have set it to uh, follow you. Although eventually you would need to res... Ah, yes, it, it's working. It's I'm not doing that, by the way. <laughs> yeah, I know. You can automatically <laughs> uh, manage to find me. <laughs> Hello, little boy. By the way, it doesn't care how far away you are. <laughs> So if I just randomly get the glitch again where I'm in a planet, you just see it raise off. Uh, yeah. Uh, oh, yes. Right, we captured this thing. Maybe we need to fill the steel plates first. Uh, Definitely. Well... Have, how do I turn autopilot? Oh, nine. Yes. <laughs> because first, I'm going to read dog. In fact, have you experienced why I have to have a button to turn off uh, the docking node? No. Uh, no connector? No. Uh, because when it's full, well, basically if it tries to disconnect itself, it's too heavy. Ah, yes. I'm going forward to salvaging the uh, large grid that we have here. Go ahead. I won't stop you. Gonna get the planetary lander so I can put everything in. I'm gonna take everything that's not what I need. By the way, the planetary lander also has the capability of follow. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Just the image of that in my mind is insane. Yeah, it might be a bit big for that. <laughs> my treasure images in my head are just a gigantic. Here. <laughs> Following you around like an obedient puppy. <laughs> if you know what a puppy is, at least. Uh, I don't. Probably in another it's language, I would. Uh, no, it's a it's a fantasy creature, a demon a demon wolf, the size of a skyscraper. Ah. <laughs> or at least a small house. Yeah, I don't know that creature. <laughs> <laughs> I may play I watch a little bit too much anime. Probably. <laughs> uh, I'm someone who, uh, well, I've watched Assassination Classroom, uh, aka. A yes, it is. The anime um, is so sad though. I uh, didn't mind at all. <laughs> well, do you? Uh, our Kamega kill was uh, just people uh, killing stuff. 
and a lot of yelling around and not doing anything, kind of. Yeah, I have a lot of... Uh, I've watched two or three animes and most of them just were screaming around for some power up or whatever and then afterward uh, well just winning the fight basically easy peasy it's uh, kind of absurd you watch i think hmm? you just watched dragon ball no i didn't well through most animes kind of too old. Really? Right, yeah, there are some uh, anime style uh, series which uh, I which I liked a lot, but uh, the uh, well animes that everyone speaks of kind of are. Uh, well, not really my thing, no. Well, I I do admit that I've watched a couple of really weird and stupid ones, but yeah, uh, I mean, easily I watched one that literally not even a full pop of plot. If the main character takes not even a full pop of plot, they went crazy overpowered. <sighs> and it's pretty stupid, but it's still fun. Sometimes stupid is equals equals fun. Meanwhile, when she's normal, because basically like she's a, multi, a completely different person, when she takes blood, uh, the second she takes blood, she basically becomes a... Unstoppable, the strongest person on the world. It was also to do with vampires and such. Sounds pretty boring, to be honest. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm probably not going to watch it, but for the first time, it's pretty fun to watch. Just to see them death and what the destruction the main character could cause. I usually don't really like the uh, overpoweredness of characters. I like when they need to have a character arc. Have you watched Demon Slayer before? Demon Slayer? No, I didn't. Well, the main character most definitely has a character arc, since he literally starts off like a boy, wood chopper, <laughs> and ends up being literally one of the strongest people in his, uh, in his group of people. Killing demons. There is what it is. What is it called? There is ah uh, oh yes, Black Lagoon. Never heard of that. Uh, it's one of the better ones, I'd say. At least uh, it wasn't the uh, typical. Uh, type of uh, anime it was kind of like uh, it's basically a pirate uh, show in anime style there's more of those uh have heard of one piece but we have who hasn't heard of one piece yeah don't like absolutely not toss this in the trash and burn it afterward and i know why just a curiosity it is kind of like too much energy and uh, <laughs> it's really hard to describe. It's just, uh, I thought to myself, okay, uh, for, wh for what people was this show written? <laughs> or um. not people for which age <laughs> most of the time. And I find myself thinking that actually a lot for a lot of different uh, animes. Some that confuse me really hard is uh, Akamega Kill. 
a uh, pretty brutal anime and it confused the hell out of me because there are dialogues that uh, feel like they were written for 12 year olds but there is an age restriction to 18 on this Is it possible to put a thousand steel plates into production at once with one click? Uh, yeah, I actually did. Uh, oh, found it. Shift plus control. Yes. That's your 50,000 steel plates. Perfect. By the way, you can also queue up uh, uh, armor blocks. So when you uh, queue up a light armor block, it automatically adds uh, 25. And when you do uh, the shift control, you add, well, a thousand of them. I think I have something to worry about. I have a medium cargo container on the mine that isn't functional. Ew. That I can't put anything into it, it's just blacked out even when I'm not holding anything. But not too I, nice. I think I somehow damaged it. Could be possible. Well, that's not a big deal. Oh, by the way, I forgot to set up the buttons. Only use the cockpit, otherwise it's not gonna work. Well, I, how do I set up the button? Uh, just disable AI behavior. Do I just toggle AI behavior? Yes. You need um, the uh, AI the oh, base. Uh, okay. Sorry. Fighter? No. The fighter, Re prepare, fight. Whoa, 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 whoa. We have a asset miracles coming on straight at us. 3.10 kilometers away. Rapidly approaching. It is rapidly approaching, yes. Holy shit. And I have visual contact. Scramble the mix. Uh, that's... Uh... Come on. Give me Where is the fighter? Trying to access it. It was right here, wasn't it? Uh, I have just produced uh, I have uh, at the ready a uh, dev ball. Hang on. Need to disconnect um, it. Do you need help? Should be fine. Somehow, I'm not really fine with this. Why isn't you working, stupid? You forgot to feel it. Did I? Yes, it has zero hydrogen. I'm in it. Well. I'm feeling it. Very well. Uh, please hop into the uh, cockpit. I'm gonna go on jetpack if it comes any closer. Actually, it was just passing. It increases distance again. Salvage is working pretty well.
By the way, fun fact. You uh, know uh, German, or at least a little bit. Uh, can't say I really do. Well, uh, you can at least understand some of it since, uh, well. Uh, yeah, because it's yes. a similar language to Dutch. Yes. Well, uh, Germans who uh, speak German. Hello. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> I absolutely exactly. knew it. <laughs> exactly last week. <laughs> uh, that's all I wanted to do. Where on earth is my body going? Oh, maybe I shouldn't have done that then. I'm just gonna fly this thing to the planet and see if I can just check out the home base with it since I haven't seen it in ages. Well, my body's a kilometer away, luckily. <laughs> I thought I, I thought I was the source of that. <laughs> <My bad. laughs> <laughs> you already did waste a shell. <laughs> I'm going to waste anti at home because I'm sending it to the planet. Yeah, yeah. that's too. I Actually, it, it can it hold itself in gravity, I believe. Although I'm not too yeah. sure on that one. Probably. It doesn't. Hydrogen thrusters cannot be underestimated. Yeah. Oh, the range is only 5 kilometers. Yeah. Didn't you have told me before then? <laughs> Would it have stopped you? Because I think not. Yes, it has stopped me. <laughs> I didn't know that because I couldn't open it before and now we have lost an entire drone. Because it just don't look crash to the planet at full speed. Uh, did you uh, turn off dampeners for that? Okay, yes. then it's lost. You. I thought I could have planned your thing. No, only 5Ks. That's the antenna range. You can oh, alter the antenna range so pretty I'll easily. I'll just use the alt.1.0 if I build it. 